Hey YouTube family, it's your girl Love Kisses 99 I'm just coming in to show you real quick how I clean my new brushes. If I'm cleaning brushes that I've used already, it's a little bit more in-depth with a few more cleansing products, but this is how I clean my new ones. Now, I'm using this towel here. This towel is actually on a slope, so that in case there's any water left, it'll run right down onto the towel and not up into the furrow of the brushes. So here we have some antibacterial hand soap from Bath and Body Works. This is the Sugared Vanilla Wish. And we're gonna also use a few spritzes of the Sonia Kashuk Brush, Brush Cleaner. And these are the two together. You can get the brush cleaner from Target and you can get the antibacterial hand soap from Bath and Body Works. And here we have two of the candle holes I repurposed. Both have clean water in them. So we're just going to use a few pumps of the antibacterial hand soap along with a few spritzes of the Sonia Kashuk brush cleaner. And we're going to use this one to rinse our brushes. I have no lighting in my kitchen. So to try to record this as I would rinse them under the sink wouldn't even work. You wouldn't even really be able to see it. So just put a couple pumps of the hand soap in and then a few spritzes of the brush cleaner. And here's a clean towel. We're gonna to use this just to eliminate excess water from the bristles and also use it to reshape the brushes. We don't want the water to go up into the furrow of the brushes or into the handle. And we're just gonna swirl this around. I did already kind of stir this up off camera. And we're just gonna rinse it in the rinse water and I'm touching my brush just to make sure I don't feel any more of the soap or any of the brush cleaner in it so it feels nice and clean. So I'm just going to press out that excess water and I'm not rubbing it. I'm just pressing it between my fingers with the towel just to get out the excess water. And then we're going to go ahead and just reshape the bristles kind of to their former glory so they'll look exactly like they did when they came out of the package and there it is the process is very easy it's not anything that would be too complicated now as I stated before I think I said it if these were brushes that had product in them I would need a few more cleaning products and a little bit more scrubbing or something like that in order to get the product out but since these are brand new it's fairly easy we just want to make sure that before we put any of these brushes on our skin that they're nice and clean. And I didn't show you all of them because there were I think 15 in the set. I just figured I'd go along and show you a few of them just to show you my process of cleaning new brushes only. I'm just reshaping those bristles. And the towel is on a slope, so in case there is any additional water, it won't run up into the furrow or the handle of the brush. And here's another brush, just kind of going over them, just to show you at least a few of them and how I do it. And there's so many tutorials available on how to clean brushes. This is just my method. There are so many out there. Reshaping the bristles. And as you can see, I'm adjusting my lighting a little bit. And here they are so far, the ones I've done. And this brush is fairly dense. Now, I've seen quite a few tutorials where people kind of dip these brushes into a solution that's really thick with soap. That's really hard to clean out of a brush that's densely packed. And this brush is very densely packed. So I am going to use the same process. It's new. There's no product on it. And here it is. It's all done. It's just, I'm just squeezing out the water. And this one doesn't really need reshaping because it's already shaped the way that it should be and the way it was out of the package. And here they are all drying. And here they are completely dry. And just as one additional step, I'm going to use my cosmetic sanitizer mist from Beauty So Clean. I'll put a link in the info area. So that's pretty much it for right now. And I'm hoping you have an absolutely awesome day today. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.